Hi everyone, and Dragon with you. So today we have the new event and the Wrath of the Earth, which they say it was reworked. And actually I see the rework here. So in the past there was like 800 points, and now we have 1000. Also looks like they reworked the amount of rewards, because previous time I couldn't go upper than 800, and this time I'm already at 2000, so that's pretty great. And actually about the quest, upgrade any hero skin 30 times. First of all, we need to find out which heroes are weakest. So we go to the bottom, for example, Morrigan is a useful hero, but she isn't developed at my account. And we just make her as hard as possible till 100 sums. That's pretty easy idea. So that's how we get skin quest done. Check which heroes aren't developed for you but you may be using them in the future, so just go forward and press as hard as you can. Same about other types. So that's how I get 40 heroes skin. 50, well, I probably will do it later, not now. Second part was about artifacts. So artifacts improve the level of your artifacts. So how I did it, actually. So I needed, I guess, 200 maybe, 200 parts. So same idea. You go to less developed heroes, for example, Fox, go to her artifacts. You see that I have a ton of artifact parts and press till you get to next level. So I recommend you to do it with gray or green parts so that you spend a huge amount of your reserves and don't get just overwhelmed. You will stop at 200, that should be enough, I guess, because that's the end of the quest somewhere there, okay? I already did it, so actually it's done. Next quest, get VIP points. As you can see, I didn't get anything. Maybe Valkyrie's favor, maybe Valkyrie's favor today, that will bring me some points. Probably that's it. Spending emeralds, I didn't spend them a lot. Uh, spending energy. Look at this quest carefully. So we have same actually idea of questing for another event, which I showed you the calculation. So that was my calculation. I told you that you probably need to remove 1000 from it because it's important. You get 500 for this event. You will probably get 500 for Andwari's event soon. I didn't grab it yet. And that's how you remove 1000 or 8 trades from this calculation. But in general, look, so we have 15,000 required here. And here I assume, I assume we also need 10 or 15,000. I don't know because I will not spend 10,000 a day anyway. So stop just here. And uh, here we have Andvari Evolution. Andvari Evolution, I already did it. And we can get his souls sometimes from other parts, okay? So I just have this here. And finally, promote Andvari to orange rank. So if you really are close to that, then maybe you consider to do it. As for me, I don't want to spend a ton of resources to make Andvari into orange. This hero is great, we play him, and actually it helps a lot. But actually, that's not the hero I'm trying to play right here, right now, that's it. Okay. So with those parts, when Andwari done quest of items done, I'm here at 3,500 and that's pretty impressive, right? So that's how I get rewards. And now let's talk about the shop. So this shop allows you to get some Andwari souls in case you want to finish the quest about his evolution. So that's an Andwari event, obviously. Also, you can check some dolls, but as for me, as for me, the most valuable of all this is either Haruyan Helm, because it's a solar artifact with orange rarity, or Alucard's Amulet. So I really need those Alucard's Amulet for my Dante. I know that Dante is a very powerful hero, but mine isn't developed yet. So I will force my Dante to rise. About other artifacts, well, depend on what you need. So I can recommend you Primark's Grasp and Shadow Queen Skies and Anvaris Fortitude Support because those three artifacts are single. So 
So you need 200 parts. You don't pay for any recipes, any gold collection. You just pay for artifact parts. That's it. So that's why I recommend it. Also, maybe a Sclepius staff or this blue plate armor. If you need them for a specific hero, then why not? So that's my recommendation about current event. Hope you can use them wisely and get what you need. And my personal choice, as I told you before, will be emulate four times. That's how I get the unity of extremes, hopefully, and that's how I get my Dante rate. Thank you for watching. See you in my next videos. And good luck to you.